right. We are back, 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 back in Daddy's Kitchen. Hello, Father. How are you? I am great. I am glad that you're great. You're looking stunning in that salmon. Lord of mercy. <laughs> I like that color. It looks really nice on you. Thank you. We are back in the kitchen again, family, again and again and again. First of all, last week's episode is sell-off, okay? People are loving our oxtail ramen. Well, at least I believe that this, you know, by the time you see this, that that would have been the last video. There might be something in between it, but the oxtail ramen video is killing, Daddy. Thank you, guys. Thank you very much for watching. I love that. So much interaction from you guys on our Instagram and on our YouTube. We're just happy that you're enjoying the recipes. And we're in the kitchen again to do something really, really cool. We were inspired by Cooking with Destiny on Instagram. And I just was like, Daddy, you have to make your version. Daddy, are you ready? Yeah, ma. I know that you guys are ready. So, Daddy, without further ado, tell the people them what we are making today. I'm yeah, making some fried sticky ribs. Fried sticky ribs? Yeah, ma. Wow. Okay, <laughs> where do we start? Where do we begin? Right here. Right here. Okay, so wagwan, daddy, wagwan, wagwan. I'm gonna get this ribs cut up and wash. Okay. So what kind of ribs are these? This is pork ribs. Pork ribs, yeah. but you could use beef ribs, right? Yeah. It's one heck of a rib. Are yes. these like baby, like back ribs? Baby back ribs. Okay. I'm going to cut off the excessive fat. Mm-hmm. Okay. So I'm going to cut this piece by piece. Okay. So I heard that you're supposed to take off the membrane. That, that no, you don't, you don't have to. You don't have to. No. Okay. All right. So you're cutting this piece by piece. Yeah. Okay. And just taking off like any additional mm -hmm. fat. fat. Yeah. Okay. Makes sense. Makes sense. Guys, when I saw uh, this recipe, I was like, no, we definitely have to bring this to Daddy's Kitchen because I feel like Daddy's version would be really, really cool. And I love ribs. So. Our whole family loves ribs, so I was like, win-win. But obviously, you guys can have beef ribs if you would like. I don't know, Daddy, maybe we should do a beef rib tutorial at some point in time, because yes. don't you, is it different? You know, does the cooking- Yeah, more different flavor from the pork. Different flavor, but the cooking like method, does it yeah. have to be different? No. Okay. Same. Pretty much the same? Yeah. Okay. Just different flavors. Mm -hmm. Okay, yeah, one more. It's funny, you guys, because Daddy was like, oh, um, I guess technically we could just make one of them, right? <laughs> yeah. And very quickly, we were, me and my mom were like, you know, just, just make it all. <laughs> because realistically, this will be gone in our house in three seconds, you guys. Gone. Especially if it tastes good. Especially if it tastes good, which is a 99.9% .9 experience when Daddy is cooking. And, so and everybody gonna beat up themselves and say, why you never cook everything? <laughs> so we're just, you know, getting straight to the point here. We have another ribs tutorial on the channel, right, Daddy? Yes. But this is a different kind of rib. You guys are gonna have so much fun this episode. I'm already having so much fun because I've never had ribs like this before. So, yeah. And Daddy's making it? We got ribs and is on right now. It's almost half a million views. Ooh, not you knowing the numbers of every video individually, Daddy. It's mine. I what I, I, <laughs> yes. I study them and I watch them. Oh, 
And that's all because we have the best audience, right? Yeah, man. You guys are the best, like, yeah. for real, for real. You guys really are the best. And if you're new here, let me just say, you might as well like, comment, and subscribe. Subscribe, people. Subscribe so I that you, you know when we're having another video, when we're dropping another video, when you know that, you know, cool things are on the way this year, so you don't want to miss out. Might as well subscribe, join the family. We're very warm. And you're going to love it here. Yeah, ma. So now it's time to wash, you guys. Yes. I'm going to wash it with lemon this time. Mm -hmm. I'm going to run out of vine white vinegar. Okay. So I'm going to use the lemon. We love a good lemon wash. Mm. Squeaky, squeaky clean. Look at that, you guys. It's just a clean up already. Look, look, look. Mm -hmm. Can't you just see it coming to life? Guys, it's important to wash your meat. Wash your meat. Not true, Daddy. Wash your meat. <laughs> More than one time. More than one time? Yes. It just looks so much cleaner already, like. Yeah, of course. I'm amazed that people like I get it, like I get the whole physics of it, but I'm just amazed that people like really don't watch. They're me. Like look at the difference, guys. Am I crazy? No, you're not. It really, really does look different and cleaner. Or maybe I'm delusional. You're just right, babe. I'm right, right? Yeah. Thanks, Daddy. All of mercy. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. What's going on? Okay. Here's all my seasoning. Mm -hmm. The dry rub. Okay. I'm making a dry rub with all different kind of um, seasoning. So seasoning which one are they? You have to let them know that it is. Yes, it's right here. Okay. What you got in here? Well, well, well. That those are what's in the bowls beside us, right? Yeah. Okay. Let's talk about the dry seasoning. The dry seasoning: um, garlic, mm -hmm. black pepper, mm -hmm. all-purpose seasoning, mm -hmm. lemon. Lemon pepper. Lemon pepper seasoning. Okay, I like that. I have some crushed pimento. Crushed pimento. And some dry jerk so jerk seasoning. Okay, some dry jerk seasoning. Yes. Okay, perfect. So that's what you put inside the bowl, but you also bowl. put brown sugar in there. I saw you. Yeah, and I put two tablespoons of brown sugar. Okay, perfect. So I'm gonna mix everything together. You never said the smoked paprika. And the smoked paprika. Okay, two spoon for the smoked Good thing I have two eyes. Yeah, man. That's why I gotta give you two eyes. As you can see, <laughs> right? <laughs> and smoked paprika, because that really see. is gonna make the difference, right? Yeah, yes. And the, and the um, brown, sugar. brown sugar. Yes. Then the liquid. Ooh, okay, yes. so these. Oh, these. this. Sesame seed oil. Sesame seed oil, you guys. I always try to remind Daddy to put that in because People, this one is the baddie. This the is a good, good flavor. Gorgeous flavor. Oh. So good. You can literally smell it right now. Sister Maggie, li mm -hmm. liquid. Soya sauce. Soya sauce. And honey. And some honey. Okay. And for those of you who are new, we call Maggie seasoning Sister Maggie. It's, 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 it's something that we, you know, it goes between. There it is. Right here. You know, it's something from our OGs. Our OGs know what we're talking about when we say Sister Maggie. But since you're new to the crew, now you know. All right. So I'm gonna pour everything right over. What was that one? The soya sauce. Soya sauce. Okay. Sister Maggie. Maggie seasoning. Yeah. Okay, guys, the aromas already. Sesame oil. Sesame oil, my favorite baddie of the crew. That one amps up the flavor. Yeah, and some honey. Some honey. Yeah, more. I 
honey is crystallized. Make it even better. You think it makes it better that way? Yeah, I'm Okay. But trust you. Not the struggle. Maybe get like a... Okay, okay. See it there, see it there, see it there. Look so at this, good. So this is about two tablespoons of honey. Okay. Which is exactly what you wanted, right? Yes. Okay. I'm gonna stir it up. The keeper, I don't have the time to let this sit overnight or uh, for hours. But you can season it from the day before and put it in your fridge. And that will like... This will just soak up all the flavors. Mm -hmm. Okay. Great tip, Daddy. Yes. And what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna put some green onions in it, some ginger and some garlic. Mm -hmm. Okay, mm -hmm. and then my rub. And then the rub. There's, it's levels to this, you guys. It's really, really levels. With love. With love. With love. And if you let this soak overnight or even for a couple hours before, it's gonna be even more busting. I mean, Denny's is gonna be busting regardless, but if you want it to soak. Mm. Oh, I wish I could. Wear this as a perfume. <laughs> <laughs> you wish you could be going around smelling like baby back ribs. That's hilarious. Not baby back ribs this season. <laughs> <laughs> but I feel you because it really does smell mm. absolutely amazing, oh, you guys. People, this flavor is kicking up a notch. Kicking up a notch. Okay, now we're cutting up that garlic. You know that necessity, you guys. Don't mm -hmm. ever think you can slip away without using it, unless you're allergic. But other than that, you don't have any excuses. Lord have mercy. Chop up your garlic. Chop up your garlic, man. It's good for you. It's good for the flavor. Mm -hmm. back up mm -hmm. yeah. so I'm saying so I'm saying we're my we ginger what you're saying look at you your spoon out look how the spoon was out already you guys are you telling me to take it out you know something <laughs> <laughs> I was, up, I was, was setting up good I was trying to give you credit and you just tell them See guys, he's yes. learning. That's alright. From me now. <laughs> yeah, that's that, that's how it's supposed to be. I was in the comments. Each one, teach one. <laughs> each one, teach one. You're, you're yes. right, Daddy. You know yeah. you're right. Each you're one, right. teach one. This, this, make this world a better place. Yes, and you're always supposed to remain learning. You know. Yeah, no negativity. Mm -hmm. Just positive. Positive vibration. Yeah. Okay. I was in the comments and you guys were like, you're right, Sasha. Daddy was about to, to, to waste the garlic in the last one. <laughs> and so I was like, Sasha, pat myself on the back for catching that. We're going to take a piece of Sasha and It's all right. <laughs> well, it's all right. Yes, it's all right. Yes, guys, take up for me, okay? Take up for me. Uh, una, una love me no, more. no, please. They can love us both. Yes. 
Yeah. Well, it seems like they ain't gonna love me. No. <laughs> never. <laughs> never, 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 never. Them just know why you lose out on the, on the ginger. The ginger is nice enough. The ginger really <laughs> is nice. This is another bright, bright flavor. This one is the one that makes the flavor pop also. Yeah, man. This with the sesame, like, there's some things I notice that when they're in there, the food just is on another level. And I feel like ginger and um, the sesame oil. Whew. I can't stop. Sir, the true and living God. Mm -hmm. Because he's the creator of all these things. Can you imagine? And all these things have their own flavor. Amazing. Amazing. I know. God, you are good. And it's it's amazing because some people will just see that and just like think like it just is. And it's like if you really think about how intricate and how all of these different things have their own flavors consistently over mm -hmm. time. People, just go back and think. All the things that in the world yeah oh great is our god incredible the creator i'm talking yes the god that created the heaven and the earth yeah man we the know. seas and every living thing in it every living the dry thing. land and every living things in mm -hmm. it and he created all these things for human being for us to have dominion over it to have dominion over it imagine and he created all the things that the beasts the birds the fish can feed off. Right? Yeah. Sure. Yeah. Yeah, daddy, same. Same. I feel you. I feel you with that one. I feel you with that one. All Lord, mercy. Glory be to God. For real, for real, for of real. Of course, of course. You're right. You, th you think we wake up ourselves this morning? No, sir. God, I wake we up. Gave us another chance. Gave us another chance. Mm -hmm. So you have to make your side right. Mm -hmm. Make your part right. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. Look at that, people. Look at that. Now I'm going to spread my dry rub on it. Okay, okay, okay. Oh my gosh. And this is what I love about Daddy, because Daddy's always gonna throw his his version on it. Of course. Okay, because some people would have left it without the dry rub. Some people would have said the sauce was just fine. But no. Daddy said, let me let me take it up a couple notches. We're done. We're not done yet. <laughs> we just are calm. We just are calm. Look at that. Incredible, Father. Incredible. Incredible. Go wash me in here. Wash your onions. <laughs> I am ready. Mmm. <laughs> this is so good. All right. So what go on now? I put it on the tray. Now on the tray it goes. So you're using parchment paper, right? Yes. Okay. It don't stick. Nothing will stick on it. No. That's good to know. Here we have a cleaner container to wash. Okay. Nothing stick at it. Why weren't you doing that when I was a kid? You guys couldn't use that clue when I was a child and had to wash all the pots. Everybody had And then everybody was mad when I said the container has to soak. Okay? They would think that it was just me scamming, but it really needed to soak. <laughs> I mean, I don't know who we are talking about, know, but <laughs> it's all right. <laughs> Listen, I am not the only one that knows the pain of that pan that needs to soak. 
Okay, I, I have to get another tray. Okay. Because it's lots of ribs. Lots of ribs. That's what happens when you have lots of pitney. And a big family. When I have lots of pitney. Yes. Four. 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 In this economy, four is a lot of kids. <laughs> Right, no. <laughs> no. 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 <laughs> well, now you have grown pitney. Big man and big woman. <laughs> Guys, the aroma, the smell. Everything that's happening right now, if you do it at home, you are going to be. <laughs> I don't even know what to tell you. Okay? But I just know you're going to be satisfied. Yeah, man. Okay, it's going into the oven. Okay. The oven is 375. 375? Yes. Okay. I'm gonna cook this for these an hour and a half. Okay. Okay. Alright. Yeah. So an hour and a half, Daddy, even though you're going to fry them? Yeah. I'm not gonna fry them for long. Just for a short period of time. Yes. So you gotta cook through them. Yeah. Okay. So an hour and a half it is. Alright. Okay, so walk on no. I'm making a sticky sauce. It's gonna go on the, when it's done, right? Yeah. Okay, so we're pre-making this sauce. So this come from the from the pork seasoning. Okay, so this is That's a little bit of extra. Okay. So you, you know you have all the flavors, flavors from the seasoning. Really? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Honey. Mm hmm Honey, oh honey. This is what's gonna give it that sticky. Sweet vibe. Yeah. Okay. Teriyaki sauce. Just a little bit because teriyaki sauce is usually salty, right? Yeah. Just a little. I'm putting some Diana sauce in it. Your favorite lady, Diana. Sister Diana. Sister Diana. <laughs> Lots of flavor in this sauce. Daddy loves a Diana sauce, okay? Every time I'm like, Daddy, no, no Diana sauce. He's like, Diana sauce, full of flavor. Diana, you hear that? You need to come and, and say hello to Daddy. Hello. Okay. <laughs> Sister Donna, I'm looking for you. Not Sister Donna, it's Diana. Okay, so this jerk, this is like an authentic wet jerk sauce. This is Walker's Wood. Walker's Wood? Yeah, man. Okay. Coming straight from yard. Straight from yard, okay. All I'm gonna say. So, uh, so much you're gonna use, Daddy? Yeah, man. Okay. Let's kick up a notch, you know? Kick it up a notch. Yeah man, so this is the sticky sauce. So I'm gonna just make this simmer. On the stove. On the stove. Okay. We come to a boil. Okay. And then you turn it off. Okay. So what I'm saying? So let me see what you're saying. Make me taste it. Whoa. <laughs> 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 Oh my god! This, <laughs> oh my gosh! Guys. Father, you are great. When it comes to flavors, when it comes to wisdom, knowledge, understanding, <laughs> you are everything. <laughs> you guys, the extraness? <clears throat> wow. This is no joke. Menor. 
Listen, I know. Just tip a little on your finger. Tip a little on my finger. Tip a little on my finger. A little on my finger. <laughs> oh my again. goodness. Wow. Come back again. These are going to be incredible. <laughs> now I know why you just ran around the kitchen. <laughs> okay. Ooh. Just, just, just take this. Just these. Just these. And okay. authentic, get some walkers with jerk, get a little bit of teriyaki sauce, some natural honey, and squeeze some Diana sauce, and butt out! And mix it up, and I put it on your up. oven, I put it on the stove. stove. Low heat. Low heat. Then you don't want it burn. Because you don't want it burn up. Then you have to <laughs> I'm good, aren't I? <laughs> Admit it. Yeah, man. I'm not too See? shabby. This is sticky already. Okay. You think that's going to be enough for all the ribs already? Yeah, man. Yeah? You have to put all the ribs in maybe a container and, and toss it instead. Yeah. Okay. I'm excited, guys. This sauce is next level. Mm. So we're gonna wait for it to boil up, and once it starts boiling, that's you when you take, take it out. Yeah. Okay. Okay, Daddy, we're doing a test. Yes. All right. Me could test it. Me could test it. Me could test it. Oh my gosh, it smells so good. Ooh. Oh yeah. Is that? Oh yeah. Okay. Oh yeah, taste it. Yeah, taste it now. Before you give it to me for taste, and make me be the judge of it. Mm-hmm. 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 Mm -hmm. We are going to eat that one. Oh, we're going to eat this one. Wait, 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 wait. Yo. Yo. Look at this. Look at that. Mm -hmm. Mommy, you want a piece? Mm -hmm. Mommy said, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It's extremely soft. Mm hmm Ooh. Mommy said. Mommy's not gonna want hers fried. This is delicious. You guys, Daddy's running over to give Mommy a piece. You think I should just run away with this? He won't know. Okay, so now you're putting them all in a container. Yes. Mm -hmm. So now, Daddy, what what's next? What what step is next? You're gonna flour them. Okay. And fry them. And fry them just yeah. a, just lightly, nothing crazy, right? No, no, that they already done. So they're done. Mm -hmm. For the most part. Yeah. I'm excited. I'm excited. Daddy was like, oh, like, let's just make them dry ribs. But I was like, no, I want them sauced at the end. Like, even if it's like a dry, like, situation, kind of. But with that nice, sticky sauce at the end. Guys, it's going to be so good. And you're going to thank me that I made him do it. Not true, Daddy. Yeah, man. Yeah, man. <laughs> Okay, so we're gonna lightly coat coat the, the ribs. Slightly, right? Slightly. Okay. Not too much. Nothing too crazy. Nope. And I mean, I guess that's a preference because some people might want like a full battered situation, but we don't want that. 
You want it just to be crispy on the outside. Right, Daddy? Yeah. That's why you do it lightly, right? Yeah. If you guys lightly dusted. Look at that mountain of dusted, well seasoned ribs. All right, then. So, what going on? What going on? What going on? Go right to the frying pan. Right to the frying pan. Yeah, but you have to clean up your space first, see? Yeah. All right. So it goes. So it goes. Let me follow you over. Right in the frying pan. I mean, some people would have their oil where it's fully submerged, right? Yeah. That's probably easier, correct? Easier, but I don't want that deep of oil. You don't want all that oil? No. Does it make a difference though, Daddy? Because it's still going in the oil. Yeah. And you still got to flip it on the opposite side. Yeah. do it side by side does that mean that it gets less you know yes, what? like less have on each side because you were saying you're going to keep it in for four minutes two minutes on each side should be fine yeah. already flipped it before two minutes. It's okay. <laughs> I will flip it again. You're just doing your thing at this point. Mm -hmm. So I'm not gonna say that these ones you're gonna leave for two minutes because clearly you just are kind of like, is there a name for that, Daddy? What? Because you are not submerging it into the oil fully. So, like, I, I feel like your your chef senses just make you flip it before the time when you feel like it. So, like, are you just, we're not going to say two minutes on each side. Kind of like, you got to feel it out almost. Just feel it out. When to turn it. Well, we're not to turn and it. when do you think is a good time to turn it? Like, how do you feel it out? Because they, they are, they cook all the way. Mm -hmm. So you don't want to over fry it. Okay. You gotta get tough on it. Okay. So you're just kind of giving it a little crisp, crisp on each side. Yeah. Okay, so two minutes might be too long if you're lightly doing it like how we did. Yeah. And if you're using shallow oil like we did. But if you're using high oil and you're fully submerging and you have more flour, maybe longer. Mm. Okay. You're hot. Sweet. Sweating. It's hot in the kitchen, you guys, but it's gonna be worth it. Okay, y'all. We're very close to the process of putting the sticky sauce on top. The sauce that Daddy made pretty much from scratch. You know, with the help of Diana and everything. But, <laughs> I'm excited. Okay, I'm cutting up some green onions. Yeah, I'm giving Daddy a joke in here today, guys. Oh my garnish. 
Okay, I'm excited for this because I love this part of garden. Like when they garnish it after the sticky part is on. Mm-hmm. And I have my sesame seed right here. Ooh, Daddy, I didn't even realize you had the sesame seeds too. Okay, I love that for us. Time to sauce these bad boys up. This is my sauce. That sauce. Ooh. Okay. Oh gosh, guys. Oh gosh, oh gosh, oh gosh. Oh gosh, oh gosh, oh gosh. Look at it. Look at it. Crispy on the outside. First of all, we love a crisp. We love a tender on the inside, crispy on the outside. Um, I want to pretty much uh, apologize to Daddy <laughs> because a second ago I was telling him, no, Daddy, I don't think this, that's going to be enough sauce for the ribs. And he didn't even use all the sauce yet. And it's very much enough for the ribs. So I'm apologizing, Father. <laughs> I was just stressing him out behind the scenes, okay, you guys? But it's definitely enough ribs. Okay, I mean, enough sauce for the ribs. All right, Daddy, so what's the next move? What's the next move? Weird. You're telling me. It's time. It's time for their plate already? Yes, yes. Jeez, you guys. Do you want some? I know they want some. Okay. Let's, Let's get that out. plate together.